Contact the field teams for a progress report. Yes, sir. Oh, Commander Shepard, we've been expecting you. Just a moment. And Hadley, could you gather the Leviathan data for us? Apologies, Commander. The rest of my team is out investigating leads right now. I'm Dr. Garrett Bryson, and this is Task Force Aurora. What's your assignment? Our mandate is to investigate legends, rumors, old stories about the Reapers before anyone knew they existed. That's an interesting goal, but is anyone doubting the Reapers exist these days? The Alliance is still desperate for intelligence. Reaper motives, their operational tactics. Anything that can give us an edge. And how did you wind up in charge? When the rest of the galaxy says something doesn't exist, I take that as a chance to prove that it does. So you're in it for the challenge? For the truth. Even as late as 2148, humanity still thought aliens were a myth. That was within my lifetime. Once that myth was proven to be reality, our entire history changed. Reapers were part of that reality, too. But even they have a history, Commander. If we could just uncover it, there may be a weakness we can exploit. Could have used your help three years ago. Yes. If people had paid more attention to your Prothean beacon, we might not be in this war. But now, with new information we've uncovered, a breakthrough is near. Hadley, do you have the data? No! This is Commander Shepard. I need C-Sec at my location, now! You shouldn't be here. The darkness can't be breached. Transit records show his name is Derek Hadley. He's worked here for a couple months. Shepard, I monitored a C-Sec alert from this location. Were you harmed? I'm fine. But I could use your help sorting this out, Edie. Take a look through their files. I need to know what this task force was up to. At once. What? I... What's happening? You tell me. I... I was gathering our data when you arrived, and then... It was dark. Cold. Like... I was someplace else. And then? I don't know! A gun was in my hand. Dr. Bryson, there was a loud noise. That was you shooting him. I didn't do it. It wasn't me. You have to believe that. So someone else pulled that trigger? But I would never do that! Commander, this does resemble reports of indoctrination. Indoctrination? Me? What about that Leviathan Bryson mentioned? How does that tie in? It's some kind of creature. Our field teams have been tracking it. That artifact came in from our researcher, Garneau. He sent an audio log if you want to... What's wrong? Turn back. What are you talking about? The darkness cannot be breached. Damn it. Get him over to the clinic. See if they can tell us what's wrong with him. Yes, sir. Commander, you'll want to see this. It's an outgoing message from Dr. Bryson to Admiral Hackett. Dr. Bryson, you have an update? Admiral, the Leviathan of Dis that we've been investigating, I think we're really onto something. Give me the brief. About 20 years ago, the Batarians discovered a Reaper corpse that had died in battle. They covered it up and denied it ever existed. But I'm intrigued by the larger implication. What could have killed the Reaper in the first place? Exactly. 
That's the real Leviathan. It's worth pursuing. Continue your investigation and update me on the progress. There is also a follow-up message from a few weeks later. Admiral, the Reapers are shadowing my field teams as if they're hunting Leviathan themselves. Whatever it is, I believe Leviathan is nothing less than a Reaper killer. Almost an apex predator, and it has them nervous. If we could just find it, imagine the impact on the war. I'm formally requesting assistance in tracking it down. You'll have it. This is now your top priority, Doctor. Find that thing. It appears we were meant to be that assistance. Anything capable of killing a Reaper could do a lot of collateral damage. Yet given the state of this conflict, I believe the saying, the enemy of my enemy is my friend, may be relevant. But we won't know unless we can find it. Bryson's assistant did say they recently received a log from their field researcher. It may yield more information. This must be the artifact the assistant mentioned. And here's the log. Dr. Bryson, it's Garneau. I'm sending you an artifact I found. About the only thing I found there, in fact. Maybe it's nothing, but... I'd swear Leviathan came through here. I'm gonna crunch some numbers. Burn up the rest of this project travel allowance. Maybe I can project our Reaper killer's movements. I'll check in when I get to the next site. Garneau appears to be our best lead to track Leviathan. But he does not state a destination. Let's focus on what he does say, then. He mentioned extrapolating Leviathan's path. And crunching numbers. He wasn't flying blind. He had data. A significant amount of data, judging by this office. So how do we narrow it down? Bryson and his colleagues evidently used a galaxy map search program in their hunt for Leviathan. It may help us locate Garneau. Does this tell us where Garnon went? No. But we may be able to narrow down his location if we find clues he was using in his search for Leviathan. in which the accused lacked a known motive and claimed memory loss. Just like Bryson's assistant. You think Garneau was following a trail of blackout crimes? It is possible. We need to find data matching dates and locations for crimes of this nature. Here's the time and date chart for the crimes. Can you filter for murders where the killer claimed memory loss? Adding the search filter, you may examine the results on the Galaxy Map program. Blackout crimes? No results. Some of our search parameters may be irrelevant. Sovereign, vanguard of our destruction. How's that working out for you, big guy? This appears to be encrypted data on Reaper fleet activity. You think it's relevant? Possibly. But it is impossible to say without more data. And the decryption key. Sir, this is Bryson. We know the Reapers are after Leviathan. Studying Reaper hunting patterns could be vital to finding it. That data is classified top secret, Dr. Bryson. If it falls into the wrong hands... It won't. The data's encrypted. I'll keep the decryption key safe. Close to my heart. Close to his heart? What the hell does that mean? Looks like data on the rack now. Their movements during the Rakdai War 
rumors suggest alien influence. But the timing is wrong. And Rachni weren't implanted with Reaper tech. What if Leviathan was preparing the Rachni to fight the Reapers? What do you think, Edie? It is possible that Bryson's team is using ancient Rachni fleet activity to find Leviathan. We saw a data pad containing data on Rachni movements earlier. It may be relevant. By Anne Bryson. Age 9. Records indicate Anne is now 28. She works for the Alliance. Bryson was keeping the encryption key close to his heart. What's closer than family? An interesting hypothesis. But I detect no trace of the decryption key in this... art. Loch Ness Monster? Plesiosaur. Loch Ness Monster is more interesting. Interesting and non-existent. Bryson was tracking unexplained creature sightings. Bryson was not merely tracking sightings. He was attempting to extrapolate a course. And Garneau could have been following that course. Edie, can you add a search filter for systems along that projected path? Adding this search filter to the galaxy map Meteorite fragment, maybe? He was studying it as an object of importance. We should look more closely at a sample. Meteorite sample. With traces of element zero. Would Leviathan need Ezo? While it is not consumed as fuel during FTL travel, element zero will decay after several centuries of active use. If Leviathan is old enough, it would need to replenish its supplies. Okay. Can you give me a search filter for locations with element zero? Adding the search filter now. Element zero deposits. No results. 
Some of our search parameters may be irrelevant. Based on the search results, Garno is in one of these five systems. I have marked the Normandy map with possible locations. We can leave now, unless you wish to further narrow the search. Signal confirmed. We have located Garno. We're about five minutes out, Commander. What exactly is on this asteroid? Mining facility. TGS Mineral Works. Small operation. Could be a good place for Leviathan to hide. We've all read Edie's notes on Bryson's lab. Any questions? Is there a clearer idea of what this Leviathan was? Not really. We only know it killed a Reaper. But it is Garneau, Dr. Bryson's associate, that we are looking for. Right. If we find Garneau, we find Leviathan. Agreed. The doctor was right. Anything powerful enough to kill a Reaper needs to be investigated. I just hope Garneau has the answers we need. I'm reading Reaper enemy signatures in the asteroid field. Bryson said they were shadowing his field teams. If they're after Leviathan too, Reapers are a good sign. That's not something you hear every day. Take us in. Don't go anywhere, Cortez. We'll grab this guy and be right out. Keep me updated on the Reaper situation. Yes, Commander. Scouting party. And it sounds like they brought some friends. before the serious troops arrive. The civilians inside are likely to be worried. Commander Shepard of the Alliance. You just had Reaper troops attacking your front door. Are they still there? I've taken care of them for now. I see. 
That will be all. That will be... Hello? Yes, welcome to TGS Mineral Works. How can we help you? Yes, for the tour. Please sign in. You don't seem worried about those Reapers. You know something I don't? TGS Mineral Works is a small to mid-level supplier of tungsten to the galaxy. That's not what I meant. Are you familiar with the applications of tungsten? I'm looking for a researcher named Dr. Garneau. He would have arrived within the last couple weeks. If he's still here, I need to speak to him. We have no Dr. Garneau. Do you need to see a doctor? How about I just go in and look around? No. The access elevator is broken. And now, we're done. Step away. Step away. You don't belong here. Bad vibe to these guys. I don't think we want to push it. Let's look around. Careful. Excuse me. You don't belong here. Welcome to TGS Mineral Works. Proud providers of tungsten since 2162. People seem fearful. It is difficult to determine why. We need to fix that elevator. But he died. I don't know what to think about that. I'm looking for a Dr. Garneau. I don't know what you mean. security log said Garno came through here in the last week. Why are they lying about that? No idea. Let's hope we don't have to look too far. seen Dr. Garneau? You shouldn't be here. Evolutionary implications of human biotics. Strange thing to be studying. I see a trend among the miners. They appear to be doing everything but mining. Turn back. You shouldn't be here. Thank you. 
what kind of stimuli is applied more quickly. Interesting. We should look into that. system is offline. This message was not sent. Bryson, it's Garno. I've had to go into hiding, and I need you to come get me. I found another one of those artifacts here. More important than we realized. It's in the mines. Here's the nav point. That's where I'll be. If something happens, I'm attaching a passcode that I hacked together. It'll open any security terminal. Bryson, something is very wrong here. Please hurry. So, he's still here. Do we have that passcode hack? Yeah, we just need to enter it at the security terminal. Garno's terminal hack and see what it gets us. Access granted. A ship dropped him off a week ago. It appears he had full access at one point before going into hiding. involved in an altercation in the mines. Garno was heading to the mines. Looks like he was taken to the med bay. You are in the mineral lab, a low security, all access area. The med bay is restricted to authorized personnel with active patient file numbers. I have the file number. Let's go get Garno. Personnel ID number is required. 
ID 231-95. Access granted. That car, no. If it is, we came a long way from nothing. If you are looking for Garneau, you have found him. I am Dr. Garneau. I'm Commander Shepard of the Alliance. Are you all right? Yes. Only I'm trapped in here. What's been going on in this place? I was doing my research, until the incident. They attacked you. It's true. But aside from my confinement, I'm fine. Bryson's research led me to you. Bryson sent you? He's dead, Doctor. Killed by his assistant. I see. I need you to tell me everything you found on the Leviathan. Bryson seemed to think it killed a Reaper. It's a myth. A dead end. But what about the artifact you mentioned in your message? I did? No. Yes, Doctor. You did. But now we've got Reaper forces attacking, so I need to break you up. We'll grab the artifact and go. Reapers. The darkness must not be breached. The darkness? Why do you pursue me? Doctor? Leave the artifact. What is mine? I don't believe we are speaking to Garneau. You. You killed a Reaper. I need your help. You bring on me. that artifact before he does. He said it was in the mines. We'll need to find a different route. Cardo's notes gave us a nav point for the artifact. Map shows a service door at the next tram station. Looks like we're not the only ones headed that way. I am noticing a pattern. Despite the law of averages, we never find the Reapers moving in a direction away from us.
That's our flank. that artifact. That. Looks like the door's power supply has been cut. There are the trouble spots. The drone can repair it. We'll need to escort it. Unfortunately, the drone is damaged and is on reserve power. Let's make it quick then.
time left. I hear you. I'm on it. Shepard, over here. What have you got? That was not Garneau. This is. It appears he's been dead for a while. So, Leviathan can have Bryson killed, can take over this colony, and he can use them as puppets. Huh. Anything else useful? Encrypted data, and a personal log with eight missed calls from a Dr. Anne Bryson. And Bryson. Who... Who are you? What are you doing here? I'm Commander Shepard. Are you all right? I think so. I feel like... I feel strange, but... All right. Do you recognize this man? I've never seen him before in my life. Someone here killed him. Someone here? How is that possible? I'm so sorry. Can you tell me anything about what happened to you? Not really. I, uh, remember... It just seemed cold. I remember a, a feeling... Cold and dark. If dark was a feeling, that's exactly what I felt. That artifact, do you know where it came from? Came out of the mine. Right. Head office was supposed to send someone. That's about all I can... Cortez, what's your situation? Can you bring the shuttle? Affirmative. Strangest thing. A couple of minutes ago, the Reaper forces broke off and left. Reaper? What's a Reaper? What year do you think this is? 2176. 2176 was 10 years ago. What? Let's arrange for these people to be evacuated into temporary quarantine. If these people have been out of it for that long, they're in for a shock. Seems Leviathan not only has the power to destroy a Reaper, but possesses an indoctrination ability. Do you think it actually is a Reaper? If it is a Reaper, then I want to know what it's up to. How long has it been out here? And more importantly, why? Edie, did we get anything from Gardo's notes? 
Yes. They suggest that Garno created a way to block the artifact's mind-affecting properties. The artifact seems to be the key. Agreed. When I head back to Bryson's office, I want you there. Yes, Commander. I want to know just what the hell these artifacts really are and what they can do. Whatever they are, they're too dangerous to have around. And we've got one sitting right in the middle of the Citadel. We need to shield the artifact they've got here right away. Using Garno's data, I should be able to accomplish this without difficulty. Damn thing's been here the whole time. Why weren't we affected? Perhaps the amount of time spent near the artifact is key. After a certain duration, it affords Leviathan an impressive mind control capability. I'd call it dangerous as hell. Bryson's assistant tried to kill me. Perhaps Leviathan was controlling him to protect itself, diverting people away from its trail. Maybe. It just shows we don't know what we're dealing with yet. Despite the risk, this artifact remains our only link to finding Leviathan. Perhaps we could find more information about it here in the lab. Agreed. Bryson's team might have turned up something we missed. I'll look around. Anything interesting about the artifact structure? It is not constructed of the same compounds used in standard Reaper technology. Beyond that, nothing of relevance. testing the artifact for energy emissions. And found nothing. Still, I recommend leaving it shielded. Edie, what project was Garno working on when he found the artifact? Basilisk. Got anything on Basilisk? Several ships, a mythical creature, and a rare mid-tier enemy type in the Galaxy of Fantasy video game. It possesses a gaze attack capable of triggering synced animation kills. Player forms describe it as overpowered. I meant the project, Edie. Oh. Then... no. There's gotta be something here on this artifact. What about the server? Bryson's assistant wiped the office server and destroyed all backups, likely before killing Bryson. However, records show new messages on Bryson's personal comm terminal upstairs. Could be worth a look. A message from Dr. Bryson's daughter, Anne. According to my records, she worked with her father. I'm at the dig site in the Pylos Nebula. Project Scarab paid off. I've got another artifact like the one Garneau found. I think it could be affecting people's behavior. You need to shield the one in your office. I tried to warn Garneau, but I can't get through. We've got Reaper scouts coming in toward the main site. I'm heading to the secondary base to grab what research I can. Anne Bryson was attempting to contact Garno on the asteroid colony. She seems to know something about the artifact. She sounded worried. If Reaper forces were approaching, her concern was warranted. Let's hope we get to her before they do. She said she was in the Pylos Nebula, working for Project Scarab. That cluster contains several systems. I'll call up the Nebula on the galaxy map. We may also search the lab for clues to narrow down her location. Reapers. Let's hope we find Anne before they do.
have located Ann Bryson's dig site. Sir, we got reports of an attack on an excavation site. Right. Edie, can you tell us anything else? This is the main site of a series of excavations established under Dr. Garrett Bryson. Staff records confirm the project lead is his daughter, Anne. She has recently uncovered another artifact possibly linked to Leviathan. That discovery must have made this dig site a target. Yes. The attack means the Reapers are one step ahead of us. We need to pick up the pace. And since Bryson's daughter is our only lead, our objective is clear. Cortez? Nothing so far, Commander. If she's down there, she hasn't responded to our hails. Getting some strange signals, though. Give me a minute. The artifact she uncovered may have caused additional complications. Agreed. Take us in closer. Copy that. We have hostiles! Take us in. Commander, on the landing platform! That's her. Okay, let's get her. This! Tracking multiple boats! Get us over there. Negative, it's too hot. Heading to lower platform. Hang on. There, go. Jump. We can't stay here, Shepard. This platform won't remain stable for long. Move. She's somewhere above us. Hello? Is anyone there? I'm coming down. No, stay where you are. This is Commander Shepard of the Alliance Navy. It's too dangerous. We'll come to you. Yes, okay. You should take the elevator up on the far side. Copy that. We're on our way. Looks like a bridge over there. Controls are broken. Someone try to fix it. Right away. Some wires are short. Shouldn't take much to fix it. Give me a second.
The elevator's blocked. Is there another way up? I'll override the pod door near you. There's an access point above, Commander, but you'll have to climb to it. Copy that. Find another way. I think we can climb through here. Commander, they attacked my assistant Hopkins. We're being cornered. Stay hidden, Doctor. in there. Move until we get there.
just ahead. Get to it! Tried to run. I told him not to, but he wanted to help the others. Where did everyone go? I'm sorry, they didn't make it. Doctor, I need you to come with me. Oh God, yes, of course. I. Uh was at another dig site when they attacked. I got back as quick as I could, but what's happening? Shepard, look. I'm not sure, but it might have something to do with these paintings. Is that Leviathan? Y yes Yes, we think so. It's, it's old, much older than my father thought. And there, as if the natives were under its power. Clearly a reaper, but acting alone. Not like any Reaper we've seen before. Doctor, I understand you found something recently. The artifact. Yes, of course. Incredible. It's just ahead. It may sound strange, but I'm certain it affects people. Their behavior. I've only had a short time to study it. Not strange at all. Did you find anything? Not much, but I did learn something about the energy it generates. Get down! doing they've activated this. I've never managed anything doctor they've learned to run the darkness must not be breached Shepard take it out got it you okay Cortez we have Ann Bryson need a pickup Copy that. You see the shuttle, you run. Don't look back. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yeah, Commander. I, I think so. I blacked out. Leviathan took control of you. We cut the connection before you got hurt. Leviathan itself? That's incredible. The Reapers seem as interested in it as we are. 
Yeah, it certainly seems that way. We were hoping you could help us figure out why. But first... Doctor, I have some bad news. Anne, please. Suppose Leviathan's broken away from the other Reapers. Never went back to dark space. Like a rogue. Or even a defector. I have to call my father. He'll want to know. Anne, you need to listen to me, okay? Your father... is dead. I'm sorry. He's... What? Dead? He can't be dead. We met with him. Hoping to find out what he knew. Something happened. Something happened? You're not the first to lose control. Your father's assistant. One minute he was fine, the next... He drew a gun on your father. I couldn't stop him. I can't believe this. We have to find out what's behind it all. You're the only one who can help us. Ben? I... I, I want to see his office. We'll arrange for transportation. Meet you there. I heard you had to break the news to Anne about her dad. I'm sorry, Shepard. So brutal what happened to him. I can't imagine what she's going through. What is it with you and rescuing scientists from dig sites that have been overrun by hostile forces? If you decide to help her take down the Shadow Broker, I'm going to be jealous and somewhat concerned. I can handle the Reapers that run around, or the ones that crawl, or the ones that shuffle menacingly toward you, but it's the flying ones. That give me the creeps. If Leviathan is a defector, a reaper that broke away from the others, then it is also a traitor. And traitors are never to be trusted, even among the enemy. If they can betray their own kind, imagine what they can do to you. Do you ever feel awkward being the only Turian on the ship? I don't know. Should I? I just mean, not having anyone else like you around. Mm, doesn't seem to bother Liara. But she can eat their food. I'm glad Anne Bryson got out safely. I just hope we find Leviathan before the Reapers do. If another harvester keeps me from dropping you off at the target LZ, so help me. That's the bond. Don't let those oversized roaches push you around. Mr. Vega, taking on a sky full of worm necks and a troop transport is like sending you against the Earth invasion armed with brass knuckles. What? You don't think I could do it? I don't know the scientific measurement of a shitload, but that seemed like a shitload of harvesters.
Hello? Anne? Are you here? Yes, I'm sorry. Just... This is hard. Of course. Are you all right? Yes. No. I don't know. <clears throat> My father and I didn't leave things in a great state. An argument? Yes. It was trivial. A disagreement on how to file some of the specimens. I was mad about something else. I don't remember what. And I took it out on him. It's so stupid. It's all right. I can come back. No, please. I'm okay. Seeing all this again. He was so obsessed. Crazy sometimes. I didn't get a chance to know him. Oh, sometimes I felt the same way. He was a great man, a pioneer, but he could be distant. I felt like an inconvenience growing up. You sound angry. I was angry. Still I am, I guess. But sometimes, he was so full of stories, he nearly burst. I loved that about him. It's why I signed up for this work. <sighs> I can't believe he's gone. We'll figure this out. We have to. I need to know what's on the other end of that artifact. What he died for. We need your help. You're our last chance. You're right. Let me dig into my father's work to see what I can find. Anne, you sure you're up for this? Yes. When Leviathan took control of me, I remember being somewhere cold and dark. But my father taught me to never be afraid of the dark. I'm still amazed your father got his hands on a piece of a reaper. He was so excited. Your claims validated years of work. Did you take appropriate steps to prevent indoctrination? Of course. It was completely shielded, and we all had regular psyche valves. But now, thanks to the artifact, I'm indoctrinated anyway, aren't I? Might as well be a Rachni drone waiting for orders from the Queen. You studied the Rachni? I wrote my dissertation on them. My father thought it was a waste of time, but now... it might actually help us understand Leviathan. In what way? We think of the Rachni as telepathic, but there's really no such thing. At short range, the Queen uses pheromones to give orders. At long range, she uses an organic kind of quantum entanglement communicator. Whatever Leviathan does must be similar. Entangling particles to stimulate neural activity. It uses the artifact to establish a connection, and then it controls the mind of anyone near it. Hey, loco. Need a hand? What brings you down here, James? Heard you're closing in on the Reaper Killer. Anything that can scare those bastards has to be worth a look. That's what I'm hoping. Commander, you see this thing? This is great! Ouch! Hey, Edie. Husk bites, they don't turn you into a husk or anything, right? I recommend you apply Metagel. We didn't detect any energy emissions from the artifact. But the Reapers were able to use the artifact to trace Leviathan somehow. 
My theory is that most of the time, the artifact simply acts as a receiver. We'll only be able to trace Leviathan through it when it actively takes control of someone. As it did on the asteroid. Right. Unless it needs something, Leviathan doesn't bother communicating. I guess it and my father had something in common. You said Leviathan's control was similar to a quantum entanglement communicator, which is untraceable. Yes, but this isn't a natural QEC. Leviathan has to send a pulse through the artifact to alter your mind and create the quasi-QEC effect. And that can be traced. Right. Just like at the dig site, the Reapers were tracing the signal by activating the artifact. My father wanted to be at that dig site. He was getting too old. Anne, I know this is hard. If there's anything more you can tell us. I don't think there's anything more I can tell you. But maybe I can show you. What are you saying? The artifact only sends out a signal when Leviathan's controlling someone. So let it control me. You could trace the signal. You mean let it take you over? That's too dangerous. It's my call, not yours. You said I'm your last chance to find this thing. We have no idea what will happen. If we wait... The Reapers will get to Leviathan first. I'm the only one here who's spent enough time with it to do this. You're looking for something to fight the Reapers, Commander. I'm looking for the monster that murdered my father. We still don't know what we're looking for. Then let's find out. Commander, this thing we're doing with Anne sounds dangerous as hell. Noted. Edie? Energy signature locked in. Waiting for activation. You sure about this? Yes. I'm sure. I'm gonna be right here. Okay. I'm ready. James, drop the containment shield. Shield is dropped. Artifact online. Anything? Nothing yet. Wait. There's something... I feel a chill. Edie? No trace yet. What the hell? Signal is tracking. Maintain connection. Turn back. The darkness can't be breached. No! <laughs> Maintain connection. Listen to me. I found you. And the Reapers are right behind me. You have brought them. You are a threat. So are you. I've seen what you can do. The war needs you. There's no war. There's only the harvest. Edie, do we have enough? Partial lock. Maintain connection to narrow the search. You heard her. We got enough. I'm hitting the shield. Do it. Man. Anne. Anne, are you all right? Yes. I think so. Did we get anything? Yes, but it will take some time to search. Coordinates sent to the Normandy. Good. It's a start. Commander, I sense something else. Anger. It knows we're getting close. I think it wants to kill you. Come on. Let's get you some help. These coordinates match our trace of Leviathan. Cortez, what's the status on the probe we launched? Tracking it now, Commander. I've confirmed that Leviathan's signal originates from this planet. Heard how, uh, Anne helped us locate it. It's pretty spooky stuff. Never seen anything like it. Can't imagine what's waiting for us down there. Dr. Bryson classified Leviathan as a Reaper killer. It appears it doesn't wish to be found. It doesn't have a choice. We're here. Sure, but now what? Let's suppose it is a Reaper. Is that the kind of help we want? Nobody says we have to be friends with it. But if this thing has the rest of the Reapers worried, then we need its help. Commander, new readings from the probe. It's narrowed down Leviathan's location. You're not gonna like it. Let's hear it. There's nothing but ocean. I show a concentration of structures floating on the surface, but the probe's giving us a signal below that. Way below. Underwater? Looks that way. The shuttle should still be able to reach it. 
that's possible. The Kodiak is spec to nearly a thousand atmospheres, but I've never actually tested that. Guess we're gonna find out. Status! Some kind of pulse hit us! Systems are shutting down! Brace for impact! Shuttle, Cortez. Checking now. I'll see if I can get power restored. Copy that. We'll look around. It would seem others have been stranded here as well. We aren't the first to encounter that pulse. Could be Leviathan's last line of defense. I'm not recognizing any of those ships. They're ancient. Looks like one of those artifacts. The place why no one gets out of here. Any idea how old these are? Your bones that clean. Real old. like a damaged atlas. Different though, and it's not flying Cerberus colors. Nice looking machine. Bet it's a wreck.
Commander, that pulse knocked it right out of the air. We're not going anywhere. What about the Normandy? Joker could swing by. Same thing would happen to her. And the landing won't be as pretty. I'd say Leviathan has some sort of defense system in place. Then we aren't getting out of here until we find it. So how do we do that? Well, you might be able to use a map. Looks like it's rigged for diving. Diving, Nick? It's a Triton model. Military grade. Repurposed for deep sea exploration. As long as the seawater hasn't corroded, it should be good to go. Well, if that's what we have to do, let's get started. Shepard, perhaps you are unaware of the degree of risk. Are we seriously proposing... First, we'll need to restore power to get that cargo door open. How? There's your answer. These old Ballard-class ships are equipped with exterior power sockets. They use them for emergency repairs. We can strip the cells from the shuttle and use those for juice. Hang on, I'll get you started. You got a cell for you, Commander. Find somewhere to plug that in.
All right, Commander. Let's get you out of there, and I'll do a systems check. Whoa. Uh, hey, Commander. Are you really serious about this plan? We've come too far to stop now. The way home is through Leviathan. Okay, SEALs, check out. Oxygen pressure is nominal. Systems are a go. It's as ready as I can make it. Let's go. Take care down there, Commander. Closing hatch. Systems ready. Testing comm link. I read you. Here goes. Commencing dive in three, two, one. Looks good so far. Copy that. Cortez? Cortez! Not sure if you can read me up there. Looks like I finished the major descent. Can't see much from here. Suit is holding up. Emergency systems have come online. Life support operation. Scanner indicates the probe is below my position. Looking for a way down. down all non-critical systems to preserve remaining power. Not sure how much juice the emergency thruster will need to get me back to the surface. Can't worry about that now. Getting some strange readings from the probe. Something is definitely down there. directly below me. Looks like the final drop.
Can't see anything just yet. Found the probe. Seems intact. I'm gonna keep moving. What's happening? Your memories give voice to our words. Your nature will be revealed to us. Accept this. The galaxy's at war with the Reapers. You defeated one. Why aren't you fighting back? There is no war. There is only the harvest. Then help us stop it. None have possessed the strength in past cycles. Your own species could be destroyed with a single thought. But you are different. I have witnessed your actions in this cycle. The destruction of Sovereign. The fall of the Collectors. The Reapers perceive you as a threat. And I must understand why. saw the other races experience. Why? You cannot conceive of a galaxy that bends to your will. Every creature, every nation, every planet we discovered became our tools. We were above the concerns of lesser species. The intelligence was envisioned as simply another tool. And now we all pay the price for your mistake. There was no mistake. It still serves its purpose. How did you remain hidden all this time? 
Our extermination is not complete. Some survived and found refuge in the dark corners of the galaxy. I am their progeny. Over the cycles, the thrall races were controlled, removing traces of our existence as we directed them to. In this way, our survival was kept secret from the Reapers. Today, we reach out from the fragments and watch for discovery. Fragments? You mean the artifacts we found? They provide a window into the galaxy. Tools for exploring the events of this cycle from the safety of this world. Through them, we watch, we study, and remain in the shadows. How did the intelligence defeat you? To find a solution, it required information. Physical data drawn from organic life in the cosmos. It created an army of pawns that searched the galaxy, gathering this data. There was no warning. No reason given when they turned against us. Only slaughter. Only the harvest. Tell me about the Reapers. Each harvest ends with the birth of a Reaper. Perfect in its design. Each formed in Harbinger's image. Our image. Each Reaper has the power to influence organics. Over countless cycles, this ability was refined, perfected, and gave rise to indoctrination. What's the point of all these harvests? The intelligence has one purpose. Preservation of life. That purpose is not being fulfilled. It directed the Reapers to create the mass relays, to speed the time between cycles for greatest efficiency. The galaxy itself became an experiment. Evolution, its tool. Will it ever end? Unknown. Until the intelligence finds what it's looking for, the harvest will continue. What do you know about the Crucible? We have watched its construction before. It has never been completed. Those who have tried still fell victim to the harvest. Its outcome is unknown. Okay, you made your point. Will you help stop the cycle? I have searched your mind. You are an anomaly, yet that is not enough. Wait! The cycle will continue. No! You've been watching. You know this cycle is different. We will survive. You will remain here as a servant of our needs. The Reapers will harvest the rest. If you release me, no one has to be harvested. Nothing will change. The Reapers know where you are. You can't just watch anymore. You have to fight. Even if you survive the battle today, the Reapers won't stop. Ever. Release me and we have a chance to end this, once and for all. I've earned it. Out there fighting, where you should be. It is clear why the Reapers perceive you as a threat. Your victories are more than a product of chance. We will fight, but not for you or any lesser race. We were the first of the Apex race. We will survive. And the Reapers who trespass on this world will understand our power. They will become slaves. Today, they pay their tribute in blood.
Commander! Snap out of it! He's freezing. <coughs> you okay? <coughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. Hell of a headache. We're lucky we got you back. I've got Ann Bryson on the comm. Good. Put her through. Commander. You feeling better? Yes, thank you. I'm doing fine. What happened? We found it, Anne. We found Leviathan. Was it worth it? It was. We exposed it. Pushed it into the light. Whether it likes it or not, it's a part of this war now. Sounds like an amazing story. One for the history books. Well, I look forward to hearing all about it. My father would appreciate this, knowing the truth is out there. In the meantime, Admiral Hack has asked me to join his scientific team. We all have our part to play. I should get to it. Take care, Anne. And thanks for all your help. Shepard up. Commander, I finished reading your report. The Alliance wanted more intelligence on the Reapers. I'd say we got it. Our people will be studying it for years to come. They're already calling it the Leviathan Codex. It rewrites galactic history as we know it. Whatever else it means, it tells me the Reapers had a beginning. And maybe now we'll provide them with an end. That's one way to look at it. I guess it's the only way. So go out there and make it happen. This is a big step in the right direction, Shepard. Good work. Thank you, sir. Hack it out. Commander? So the Reapers did not fully exterminate their creators. That suggests they are fallible, even on large or long-term scales. You took a huge risk down there. Almost died to figure this out. I've been thinking about what we learned, Shepard. The thing is, I don't really care what the Reapers are or where they're from. They're monsters that need to be put down. That's all I need to know. I can only imagine talking to something so huge, so alien. I hope it helps against the Reapers. Shepard, I looked over your mission report. Gotta say, it feels like we've been after these Reapers forever. From Sovereign to Leviathan, they've been a pain in the ass the whole time. But at least we're starting to see the big picture. Never really thought we'd get any answers. Doesn't change much, but it does make this war feel a whole lot bigger. I have studied your human religions, Commander. Your devil and his fall. Leviathan and its kind deserve the same fate. They once unleashed a plague that has haunted all of our history to this day. I say their own hell is the abyss you found them in. One I hope they never escape from. Okay, toughest mission. Horizon. No fear, I hadn't joined up with you yet. Fine, the Dead Reaper then. Really? The husks just ran up to us. Have you ever noticed that I carry a sniper rifle and you're the one who likes things at short range? And you prefer to keep everything at a distance. Exactly. Wait, what? Creepiest thing we fought. The Thorian. But wait, what did you mean? I didn't mean anything. I'm going with the Rachni. The Queen? But we didn't fight her either time. No, the little ones. They look like spiders and they scuttle right toward you. I thought you liked it when things got up close and personal. I guess it depends on who it is. Can't say I was happy sending you down in that submersible by yourself. Don't know why I ever worry about you. Take on ancient aliens from the deep? Sure, no problem. With the Leviathan on our side, maybe we pull this thing off after all. Maybe, James. At least Anne's still around to see her dad's work finally pay off. <laughs>